How's it going everybody, Budget Pokemon here, and in this video we're going to be opening a very very special set to me personally. We are we're going to be opening Alter Genesis, a bit of an older set from the Sun and Moon era. And this has one really really amazing card that I would love to pull, which is of course these three. The Arceus Diaga and Palkia GX alternate art, which is a really amazing card, really really cool looking. Unfortunately, really expensive, but the booster boxes are still rather cheap compared to others, so I thought I'd give it a shot. That's not the only card. I mean, that's the main card you want to pull, but since this is an older set, you can also pull the um, the Tag Team GX cards as well as the Tag Team Trainer cards. I can get this open. There we go. I want to keep the box in, in good shape. And there we have them, the booster packs. Really cool looking artwork. I really love this, and let's see what we can do in this one. Let's see what we can do. Put this over here. Let's try to open this up. Hopefully I haven't forgotten how to open these up. Seems to be going well so far. Let's see, yeah, there's the awesome... So we have a Dartrix to start it off. An Apom. A Cosmone. Oh, nice! And right off the bat, a GX card. A Flygon GX. And a Vibrava fitting. That's really cool. A nice pull in our first booster pack. Uh, this is also where the the um, Rainbow Rare Flygon is from. Actually, let me open the right side first and then move over to the left. So this is where the Rainbow Rare Flygon GX is from that was featured in my um, budget mail day. If you haven't seen that, go check that out if I can get this open. There we go. There we go. It was hard to open, so there are, that means there must be something in here. As we have a Sun Current. No Runt. A Golurk. No, that's not Golurk. We have a Red and Blue Tag Team card. There is a full art of this one in this set, which is really cool. So let's see what we can do. And a Heliolisk, I think. Having trouble with these new names, I'm actually going to put the... The red and blue aside, I think that's a really cool card. These tag team trainer cards as well as the tag team Pokemon. I've said it in a few videos before. I'm really hoping the Pokemon company brings them back, you know. I mean, there is an opportunity for like tag team EX cards or just like any. Tag team V, tag team anything. Because they're so, such a cool concept. Yo, look at this. This is such, such a cool illustration. It's like water painted or like with... Like digitally, this is really cool. I like this. Oh, nice! We have a Lycanroc. I think this is the midnight form of Lycanroc. And we have a Tack Whistle. So let's see if the Secret Rare will hide in one of the earlier packs or in one of the later packs. And let's see what the what the um, Secret Rare will be. Okay, that took way longer than I would like to admit. Something wants to keep me out of this pack. I can feel it. It may, it may be our Secret Rare. It may be our Secret Rare. Just as a precaution, let's do the card trick for the Japanese packs. Let's see if the secret wearer is hiding in here. That's the feel. Actually, let me go back. Look at how happy this feel is. Oh, I like this card. I'm actually going to put this aside as well. This is nice. And... Okay, not our secret wearer. Not our secret wearer that was trying to keep us out. So the search continues. But it's nice. It, I really like opening older sets. Unfortunately for English, that is very expensive because most of the older sets are crazy, crazy expensive now. In Japanese, it's uh, it's whatever. Some are cheap, some are more expensive, but this is one of the cheaper ones. Definitely not cheap at all, but you know. A, a holographic Solgaleo. Nice. Something shiny and a lantern. This is a really nice change from all the English products we've opened. As you know, I do love opening Japanese products because I feel like they're... Like, the quality and everything just feels so much better, as well as the cars, as I've said in the in the video last week. Like, the silver borders just look so much better than the yellow ones, in my opinion. Let's see what we can do. Teddy Ursa. Oh, there it is. There's the... Oh, no, that's just the Arceus statue in the background. It's not the trio statue. Cricketoon. And a Cynthia and Caitlyn tag team. This is also one of the cooler tag team... Um, artworks in this one, or the full arts. There's also a Guzma and Hala, and a Mello and Lana, which is whatever. I think my favorite one is the red and blue, just because of how iconic it is. Right after that would be Cynthia and Caitlyn, probably. 
Uh, I would be happy with either of those pulls, but then again, the Arceus, Dialga, and Palkia GX alternate art is what you're chasing. But let's see what we can get. An alone in Sand Slash or a Sand True. There we go. That's the that's the right one. Holographic and a Drampa. Actually, I have to look that up. I have the card list open on the monitor here, just so I can look up some of the cards that I don't know the name of quickly. So I keep bumping my camera, which is no good for the video. I mean, I always, I would always love if the secret wear was like in one of the last packs, because that just makes it so much more exciting. But we'll see what we can do. We got a Floet. Nothing in here. Swana. Oh, here we go. There's the third one. Now we only have to pull the Gazma and Hala. There is the Mallow and Lana. Tag Team Trainer card. So many amazing cards in, in this one. It's a really, really cool set. Like, the artworks in this one. Really, really cool. Especially, like, this feel, as I've shown you earlier. Really cute. And... Speaking of Sphere, there's another one. Look at how happy it is. Is it happy or is it screaming? You tell me. I think it's just happy. It's happy to see us. Sankern, also happy. And an unidentified fossil, I think. Okay. Whew. Volcarona GX. I mean, there's just something about seeing these GX cards, which by now are kind of old. So it's really cool to see those, like instead of the usual V cards that you would normally get in in packs these days. There's just something kind of nostalgic about it that I just love. So let's see, we should get, I think, two or like three more GX cards. And then of course our secret rare. If I can get this pack open. Our secret rare, we got a snow run. Got a the pre-evolution of Dartrix, I've forgotten the name of. Got a... Apple? They've got a... Is that white or black Curum? I think that's black Curum. Really cool looking hollow. And a... Braviary, I want to say? Yeah, Braviary. So far, the, the secret where it hasn't shown itself. But, never doubt, it will show eventually. And it will be the alternate art Arceus and Palkia GX. Ganazumeru. Ooh, nothing in this one. I'm just pulling it slowly away to see if there's anything. Oh, there's small white. This is also really cute. There is the uh, Lopani and Jigglypuff tag team card in the background. Look at this. And also the mole wire is, is super cute. This is also a cool card. I'm just gonna put this aside as well. I should put the other Sveal away as well. So let's see. Would love to get the other tag team card, the Guzma and Hala, to complete the set. But. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh, okay. Got a bus wall, I think. Yeah, bus wall. And an Ursa ring. On a mountain, of all things. It's like training or something. The right side is almost empty. We have three more packs. They were in this order. Let me just put the booster pad or booster box aside for a bit. And open the last few picks of the right side and then find out where our secret rare is hiding if it's whoops or if it's hiding on this side or if it's hiding on the other side let's see no secret rare no secret rare so far nice this is also a really cool one I like this one a Cradilly. okay nose pass Got a Jagamolo. Got a Ducklet. Ooh, okay. We've got an Oricorio GX. And a Golurk. Okay, this is a Golurk. The other one is called the Golurk, the pre-evolution. Oh, hang on. I got to get a sleeve for this one. I'm still struggling with the newer names. I haven't come around to playing uh, Pokemon Sword and Shield yet. I still want to do that. But haven't haven't gotten around to playing that yet. Because there's a lot of Pokemon in there that I don't know. So I'd like to, to know at least the English names. So let's see. Maybe our secret rare is hiding in this one. Maybe our secret rare is hiding in this one. Nope. Nothing yet. We've just got a 
Beast Tide. Weird name. And a Alolan Sand Slash. That's a Sand Slash. The other one was a Sand Shrew. Still getting used to it. Okay, so here we go. The other side of the booster packs right here that we have left. Let me just move this over. This was the, the left side. Let me just move it over so it's like kind of in the picture. And see where our secret rare is hiding. Or maybe it doesn't have a secret rare. That would suck. Not getting a secret rare. That would be bad. Okay, let's see. Not yet. It's still hiding out there. Or by the way, there are still fairy Pokemon in here because, of course, it is an older set. So there is still fairy Pokemon in here. Which were discontinued. They were put back to Psychic, I think. You can use uh, Psychic Energies on them. Just so to make it easier. An Anorith. That's not our secret rare, it's just a rare. It's a really cool looking rare. Holy moly, check this out. Alola Ninetales. This is a really cool one. Also, one thing I do prefer about the, the English or the Japanese cards, just the rares, just look at them. Also, the border is like shiny, which I really love. These this 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 makes look rares like way better than the rares that we get in English. Okay, cleaned up a bit. Let's continue. I have heard rumors of like reprint books. I don't know if this is a reprint box. I don't think so, but sometimes reprint boxes don't have secret rares. I, I, I don't know if that's true or not. There's another Caitlyn and Cynthia. This here. But no, I... This has to have a secret rare, right? Okay, for some reason that pack was really, really hard to open. That means there must be something good inside. I can feel it. This is this is our secret rare. We got a Sylveon. Got another Apom. A Sunkern. Osmoan, there is something shiny. It's not our secret rare yet. It's a Decidueye with really cool looking artwork. Nice. I saw something shiny. But it isn't the secret rare yet. We still have a few packs left to go. We'll see when the secret rare will show. I mean, I like this. It, like, it builds suspense. If I could open these packs. There we go. It builds suspense. Like the secret rare being at the end of the, of the booster box. And nothing in this one. Still not showing its face. That means it has to be something good. That's how it works, right? Like, it has, at this point, it has to be the Arceus GX. They wouldn't do us like this. They wouldn't put it at the bottom of the box just for it to be like a, uh, a Volcarona GX full art or anything. See? Yo, that's... It's, no, that's not our secret rare. That's just a normal double rare. That's a Lopunny and Jigglypuff GX. There's also an alternate of this one, which is also a secret rare. But this is really, really cool. This is really nice, DG Lopani and Jigglypuff GX. I like stopped for a second because I saw this card and I thought this was our secret rare, but no. Maybe we pull the secret rare of this, who knows? Who knows at this point? But this is a really cool G GX card. I do, I just love the concept of tag team Pokemon or like tag team trainer cards. It's just so cool to me. Let's see? Nope, not in this one. Not in this one, there's another Mellow and Lana GX Tag Team Trainer card. We have a few packs left. Yeah, we still have plenty to go through. Plenty, plenty to go through. Plenty more chances for the Secret Rare Pull. I keep going on about the Secret Rare Pull, but this is very, very special. Because the Secret Rare is incredible in this one. If you get the right one. Maybe in here? Nope. Just a normal rare Komoo. Como, como o? Something like that. Something like that. And a Probo Pass at the end. I mean, also the Arceus, the Agon, Palkia GX, like the rainbow version of that is also really cool. There's a few cards I want to pull in this one. I'm not just chasing the Arceus and Diago and Palkia um, GX alternate art. There's a few cards in, in here that I would be would be chasing. There's a nice, cute looking more while. With the... With the low pony and Jigglypuff in the background, look at this. Let's see, Ducklet. 
Azumarill, Nose Pass, and a normal rare. Okay, we've got a uh, Lunala and a Swana. Few more packs left. Let me get rid of the the box. Put the booster packs here. We're going towards the end. I'm kind of getting nervous now of uh, this box not having a secret rare. I'm kind of getting nervous now. Maybe it should be showing soon, if it does have one. Sveal, Eevee, Nun Coleman, and a... and a Glalie. Very cool, very cool. I mean, there aren't that many chances left for the secret rare now. Maybe, maybe, hopefully the rumor doesn't, like, isn't true that there are boxes with no secret rares. But you never know. You never know, Teddy Ursa. Okay, we have our secret rare. There's a secret rare under this. You know what? This is, this is our secret rare right here. This is our secret rare. I'm gonna tease you a bit. Oh, nice, there is the Guzma and Hala. I'm gonna tease you a bit. I'm gonna keep this for the end. We're gonna put this in a sleeve right here. And we're gonna look at this at the end of the video, which isn't long. We still- we only have three packs left to go. So let's just get through this quickly, I suppose, and then let's see what our secret rare is. So Togedemaru... And there we go. That was that pick. Maybe we get another GX card, that would be kind of cool. There might be two secret rares, who knows? It is possible. So there is our secret rare. Unidentified Fossil, Flebebe, Braviary, and the Sunflora. Okay, we don't we don't need Lost Pack Magic. We have found the secret rare. Let's see what it is. And, oh, whoops. There is a... That's a Cherish Ball. I wonder what the, what the actual card is called. Oh, the actual card is called Cherish Ball as well. And here's the other cards. Okay. Moment of Truth. What is this secret rare? Is it the Arceus? What is it? Let's flip it around. Oh, okay, it's the Naganaddle and Guzzlord GX. Dang it. Dang it. Okay, it's not the Arceus. Still, it is a tag team card. Not the pool I've wanted, but I'm still happy. Let me just put these into view. There you go. That was still very fun to open, this Ultra Genesis booster box. If you did enjoy this video, then give it a like. If you really enjoyed the content, then consider subscribing. Stay tuned for more videos in the future, and thank you so much for watching this one. See you later. Peace, peace.